Mm-hmm. And they're going to narrate to each other, uh, for each other, with the style of some music we picked out. What I need from the audience is an <coughs> unlikely place for a film noir scene. Airport terminals. Airport terminals, first thing I heard. Air- Airport terminal. <laughs> Airport terminal. Airport terminal. Uh, so you're acting out a film noir scene set at an airport terminal. Go ahead. <laughs> I had to leave the country. Leave the country fast. I've been involved with a poultry scam that went bad. There was only one chance. Big wing boy. <laughs> Excuse me. I need a flight out of here really fast. Oh, really? I'll see what I can do. I knew what he wanted. <laughs> He wanted a big wing boy, but I hadn't done that for years. Seems we have a flight going out at 7.30. It's only going to Pomona. Pomona. How ironic, that's where I was running from. No matter how hard I tried to get away, it would always pull me back. I want to go to Fresno. Fresno, huh? That's a lovely town. (laughs) It wasn't. (laughs) Why don't you see if your carry-on fits through the hole there? (laughs) Make up your own joke here. All right, if you just step through the metal detector. Beep, 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 beep. I knew he was going to set it off. I knew he had had that metal plate installed in his head three years ago. That's where all the hair had gone. Take it from me, big wing boy. I realized when I set off the metal detector, it was just Big Wind Boy going. (laughs) But I thought I would humor him. After all, he looked like someone who had never had any humor in his life. (laughs) Maybe this is what set off the alarm. Get me a ticket, get it now. (laughs) We'll be right back with more Whose Line Is It Anyway? Thank you.